Oh my god, they're so cute! <gasps> Look at them! Oh, they are like meant to be, guys. They are meant to be. Wow. So they had a good woohoo. They did. Pleasantly satisfied. Was she pleasantly? Yep, she was. She. Oh my god, no! Chance of twins! We cannot have two more babies! Oh my god, I forgot about that! If we have twins, I'm gonna kill myself because oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to part 13 of Let's Play The Sims 4 Parenthood. Not toddler life, Matthew. Not toddler life. Okay, so we're picking up exactly where we left off. In the last part, I did put in a restaurant in Willow Creek. We will have mom and dad go to that tonight for their proposal or for their date. He, Jackson, is going to actually be taking Amanda out on a surprise date. She has no clue about it. She doesn't know what's going to happen at all. And he will propose to her on that date. So I'm super duper duper excited for that. So let's go ahead and jump on into this. Everyone's sleeping. Jackson actually has work today. Does Amanda have work today too? Yeah, they both have work today. They both get off at 5. So we're going to have them go out and do their thing at 5 o'clock today. But um, since they both have work today, his work starts in an hour. Her work starts in two hours. We got to make sure that everyone is pretty much good for their promotion. She's going to get promoted today. I'm really feeling that she's going to get promoted today. He's hungry, but I really want him to do his programming for the day. So I'm actually going to have him sit down at the computer and work on some freelance work. I'm going to have him continue that. Oh my goodness. Who's this? I don't even know their names. I've completely forgot their names. Chloe Cooper is getting out of bed. She needs bladder. She needs attention. She needs a bath. She is just all shades of pissed. I don't even know what to start with because we got promotions coming today. So I'm going to wait till the nanny gets here and we're going to take care of that. But in the meantime, I think I'm actually going to have them um, get fed. So let me say we have five days left on that, two days left, six days left, and one day left. So we're going to go ahead and pull out scrambled eggs with bacon. This is what we're going to have for breakfast. <laughs> scrambled eggs with bacon. I know you're so sad. Oh, had a nightmare. Oh, my God. I feel so bad. Oh, I feel bad. And you can have them play in the cabinets. Isn't that cute? That's adorable. That's just adorable. All right, go ahead and grab a serving. Kayla, when are you getting up out of bed? Kayla's going to be getting up any second. She's actually she's actually feeling quite happy. She just needs a bath. So we're going to have um, the nanny go ahead and give them baths when they arrive. But I'm going to have her continue sleeping so that we can keep the peace in the house while we can. You don't want to eat? Or I think she grabbed food. I can't even click on them. Yeah, there we go. Look at her! She's so cute! <gasps> She's so cute! Kayla's gonna be getting up soon, and he's actually feeling pretty happy right now, but... Yeah, she's pretty pissed. Ask Amanda for a drink, babble to Amanda, and ask Amanda to play. Well, Amanda's gotta go to work. They both have work today, so we're gonna have to keep their needs for the nanny when the nanny arrives. So we're just gonna have her go ahead and eat. Just to get something up for the meanwhile. Oh, select a branch for Amanda Cooper. She can either be an arts critic or a food critic. The food critic pays more. It's 10 to 4 and this one's 12 to 5. Oh, I do want her to be a food critic. You know what? We'll have her be a food critic. Why not? Wow, Amanda has been promoted to Chow Chaser. Whoa, I need to turn my speakers down. That's going to give me like a lot of feedback. <laughs> Amanda has been promoted to Chow Chaser. She will now make an additional 15 simoleons per hour for a grand total of 49 simoleons per hour. She has also received a following bonus, 438 simoleons, spare utensils, wall plaque, and review food slash drink interaction, which is pretty cool. Her next shift is Thursday to... Okay, so she does work today. Thursday at 10 a.m. Awesome, awesome sauce. Let me go ahead and delete some of these notifications from the notification wall. And let me go ahead and pause this and see how Jackson's doing with his programming. Does he have 100%? He's only 25% done and he's got to go to work. Oh, I knew he didn't make it. I knew he wouldn't make it. I'm hoping that we can get him promoted though. So I'm going to have him go ahead and head to work. He'll probably end up eating at work anyway. And I will have her go to work as well how is this fun oh his fun is perfect okay so we're gonna have him work hard today 
And she got her promotion, so I honestly doubt she's gonna get a promotion, so I might actually not have her work as hard. Actually, I don't want them to be stressed when they get off from work. So we're actually gonna take it easy today, only because we're gonna have our date and our proposal tonight, and Jackson knows that, so he's not gonna take it um, as seriously at work today. But I'm hoping he can still grab that promotion, even though he's taking it quite seriously. Or t tight e- Ugh, I can't speak, even though he's taking it quite easily today. Hopefully he can still snag a promotion. Let's go ahead and have this shower here. And is it time for work yet? Yep, it's time for work. And reach thinking level 2, Caleb can now study shapes on the nesting blocks. Awesome. Are they all sad? I feel like they're all sad. I'm not gonna send them to daycare, I'm actually gonna hire a nanny. That's the more realistic approach to this. And I'm going to have you go ahead and write some reviews. Oh, lowers work performance. Increased writing skill. Offers a chance to get... Fo Whoa. That's weird. Okay, well, we're just going to do normal then. We're just going to do normal then. Hello, why are you knocking at the door? Do you expect a toddler to let you in? That's what I thought. You have to let yourself in. All right, what's going on? What's going on? You're. I know you're sad. You need a bath. You need a bath. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to ask for a bath. We're going to ask for a bath. You're actually doing pretty well. Oh, my God. I knew that food would go bad. Oh, I knew that food would go bad. Oh, I guess we're not going to be eating anything then. And we probably can't get potty help. I'm assuming. Please give me a bath. Please. Got my way. This toddler's this toddler rules the roost. Not so large, but definitely in charge. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, and she's gonna get a bath. She's getting a bath. Kayla is just a helpless toddler. Caregivers and other sims in the household will need to help take care of her. I know how to take care of my children. Don't tell me what to do. Oh, now she's feeling playful from the bath. I'm happy. I'm glad, because she really needs it, to be honest. She had a bad nightmare this morning. She was all irritated. Thank you for giving me a bath. She's a great nanny. And you know what? Our relationship with her is probably going to end up being really good. Yup. Her name is Aya. And we're, she's going to have, like, the best relationship with us. Um, let's go ahead and make some silly faces to her. We're going to go ahead and babble to her a little bit. Where are you going? 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 What's going on? Are you going to potty train, or...? That's so cute. Oh! Make silly faces. She's happy, though. I am so happy about that. Now, how do we ask for food? Why won't it let us do food? High chair is required. <gasps> Shoot. Well, let's pull out another... plate of something. All right, come grab a serving. Come grab a serving. You're hungry. Actually, I'm going to have them all come grab a serving. They're all hungry except for uh, Chloe. So I'm going to have Chloe skip out on that. Oh, there you go. This is what you need. You need a bath. And her fun's going up. See, this is why bubble baths are perfect. Even though I don't think it's a bubble bath. It might just be like a regular bath. <gasps> I gotta get some screenshots. This is adorable. This is adorable. She's got her little rubber ducky and everything. She's just so happy. Aww. Smile for the camera. <laughs> Aww, it's so cute. And she just needs more attention. That's pretty much it. Um, let's go ahead and play. Let's make silly faces. Let's babble. Let me see what else can we do. Can we be funny? Yeah, there aren't many funny interactions. Um, let's do flashcards. Learn basic needs. Aww. This is exactly what they need. They just need this attention. That's why I'm glad that both of them go to work. Because they're able to, you know, earn money get their work performance up and they're able to 
get full attention because they have a nanny. So I feel like going to work and hiring a nanny is awesome. Plus it's realistic because you have to end up paying for the nanny at the end of the day. That's adorable. That's so cute. And now Kayla, see, it's going to be hard to, to get these names permanent in my mind. Kayla's the one with the little hat. Chloe's the one with the pigtails. I gotta remember that. Pifatel Felinus. Awavine. Floopy. Balafoy so Gamus. Awavine. Vena Garza. She's feeling Whip. sad from playing. Oh, because she got an ouchie while roughhousing, so she doesn't want to play anymore. Aww. Make funny faces. Hopefully that'll cheer you up. Snuggle. A blish. Gishal. Tribnathenib. What else can we do? Learn basic needs. There we go. That's cute. So they're doing flashcards now. This is exactly what she needs. You know what? We could a ask, actually ask for potty help. I just remembered that. We could totally ask for that. And it is 2 o'clock p.m. So I'm actually going to have them nap. Because there, it is good to give toddlers their own nap time during the day. So I'm actually going to have them nap for a little bit. She needs to nap the most. That's so cute. Isn't that adorable? I wish you could hire more than one nanny. But actually, that would be that would just be way too much money. Aww. That's adorable. Okay, you need to go nap now. And we're gonna have Kayla get potty help. Alright, let's get some potty help. Let's get some potty help. Nanny. Where are you taking me? You taking me to um, Caleb's potty chair? Oh, Amanda brought home 294 simoleons today. She did some great work too. Awesome, you might actually keep the nanny here because of the whole potty training thing. Uh, but we're gonna have her go ahead and pee because she really, really, really needs to pee. <gasps> oh, look at her. It's awesome coming home and seeing them. It's just adorable. Whoa, she wants to throw a tantrum. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, she's throwing a tantrum. I wonder if you can discipline them for that. Oh, wow, that's funny. Ask not to have emotional meltdowns. Legit me. People legit need to say this to me. Don't have an emotional meltdown, baby. Ask not to make a mess. Her manners aren't going up from that. I noticed that. I noticed that. Okay, we're gonna clean up this house because this is absolutely disgusting. Let's clean up these dishes. Jackson should be home from work any minute. And we are going to go out on a date. What a day. I know. What a day it has been. So we're going to go ahead and we'll give her a tip. And then we'll dismiss her. We're going to give her a tip because she does a great job with our kids. She makes sure that their needs are full. She teaches them like potty and flashcards and all that awesome stuff. So oh, I don't just want to dismiss. I want to give you a tip first. Give her a tip. Give her a tip. There you go. That's awesome. Does she just like leave after you give her a tip? She looks snooty. Look at that walk. She's not leaving actually. We're going to dismiss her. We're going to dismiss her. No, we're about to go out on our date. There we go. Guess I'll be done here. Oh, that's only 139 simoleons. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cheap, actually. All right, so we're going to go out on our date. So let's go ahead and go under romance and ask out on a date. And they do have to wear their formal attire out to this restaurant. And you guys will see it. I did plop a restaurant down from the gallery. And I changed, like, the lot traits. I changed the um, the chef, you, you know, the chef's outfit, the waiter's outfit, the waiter's outfit, the hostess's outfit. And I made it so that you have to go in formal attire. So, this will be pretty exciting. And didn't I just hit ask out on date? 
there we go and then i guess we're gonna have to fix that sink when we get back because that's kind of irritating and this is what it looks like it's called so cool brazooka grill so the traits are chef's kitchen romantic aura and sunny aspect so when they're there they just get this like romance aura so they're just gonna want to be like all lovey-dovey kissy all up on each other but i'm so excited because i never used the museum that is there so i was like i might as well replace it with something that i'm actually going to use and i was like oh my god let's put down a restaurant because i don't really go to restaurants like that in my lps and we have the dine out pack so it just makes sense doesn't it it just makes sense so here it is i will go ahead and give you guys a little tour i didn't build it at all caleb kayla and chloe have been sent to daycare the kids are in good hands so this is what it looks like and like each of the tables has like a little thingy on it i'm hoping that they can still eat at the tables despite those things being on it because they're pretty big and they take up the whole table but there's like a little spaceship thing outside for the kids when you walk up oh it's so beautiful i love it oh i love it so much look at it just the building is beautiful and it's right by the water i'm gonna go ahead and take the walls off just so you guys can see what it looks like when you come in here you have your hostess stand so you can have a seat wait is this bar side i think there's either a bar side or like a restaurant side i think that's really cool so you know you can have a seat there's an area down here there's a little oh my god there's a dance floor there's a dance floor there's some arcade machines that's so cool oh my gosh there's a lot to do with this restaurant that's pretty cool Oh, look, and they're both wearing their formal attire. Oh, this is going to be such a good date. Well, let's be romantic to her before we even get into the restaurant. We got to get her in that romantic mood. So we want to flirt with our date. We want to request the table. We want to socialize with our date. So let's go ahead and flirt a little bit. We're going to be a little flirty. We're going to express fondness. Um, we're going to go ahead and embrace her. We're going to compliment her appearance. We're going to caress her. And we are going to blow her a kiss. They are so cute, guys. Darpsa. Aren't they adorable? <laughs> ah. This is their post-engagement dinner. Aww. They're so adorable. I can't wait for them to get married. And they're, they already have kids, which is what's crazy. And they're still not married. So. That's definitely something that we need to focus on. Oh, it's so cute. Socialize about meal. All right. Well, we got to go inside and request a table. Because that's one of our goals. So let's head inside and request a table. Now, what do we click on? Do we click on this? Or do we click on this there we go request a table hopefully they sit together i'm hoping i'm hoping that since they're you know in a group that they're gonna be able to um sit together because i know that in the what was it the sims 2 or the sims 3 they would always like sit separately and it was extremely strange oh we're eating outside oh it's oh, that's so perfect you guys what a romantic dinner look the sunset we have the water right there the trees in the background oh i love this so much i really like this dine out pack and i really did not fully explore it that's the thing so i'm gonna be taking a lot of pictures today guys because this is an important night and a very important meal Look at them. They are so cute together. This is what I need to do more. I need to go out and eat out on the deck during the sunset. And oh my God, I'm just, I live, I live, I live, I live, I live. Okay, so how do we order? Do we order food? Order food for yourself and your date. Oh my God, they get menus. <gasps> That's so cool. And look, they have little moodlets. Hot dinner date from requesting a table at a restaurant. Dinner check jackson's favorite sim ever check everything is wonderful that is so cute that is so cute that is absolutely adorable and he wants to order a drink and what are you doing she's like i'm browsing the web i don't care i'm browsing the web why are you lovelorn no sit back down don't be going to the bar you guys are ordering together oh okay so i see you click on the table to order i see Draw on placement. Oh. 
That is cool. You know what? Let's have them both do it. Draw on the table. That's so cool. Look at them. They're acting like little kids. That That's funny. What? Amanda Cooper has abandoned her current dining table. If she wants another table, she can request one from the host. Why did she abandon it? Let's have them both do it. It just says order for table. I want to order for myself. Hmm. Maybe we have to hit that. Let me try it first. Drishy! Ah, okay. Appetizer. So what are we going to order first? Well, we need to pick a drink first. That is so cool. You can select different stuff to order. Oh, uh, you know what? Let's have expensive drinks. We're going to both have expensive drinks. Um, and we are going to start out with the appetizer. So what are we going to have? Um, chef's choice, bowl of olives, breadstick, cheesy bread. You know, we're going to have her grab a salad. And um, I think Jackson will just have... Um, oh, hello. Jackson will have squash soup. And we're just gonna go ahead and order that so far. We're gonna order that so far. And then we'll have an entree. Wait to place order. That's awesome. That is so cool. That's just so cool. I wish we could like, oh, never mind. I was clicking on the wrong Sam. That's why. That's why. Okay, well, let's boast about family. Uh, save? That's cool. I live for this. Oh, let's just flirt. Let's just flirt. Because we do have to socialize with our date. Let's go ahead and be enticing. We're going to go ahead and blow a kiss. We're going to go ahead and remember, we have to do stuff that doesn't require us to get up. So let's do compliment appearance. We'll express fondness with her. Oh, there we go. So we got our main goal. We're actually already at a silver date, which is awesome. And let's go ahead and... A lot of this stuff requires us to get up. We'll do sexy pose. <laughs> There's so... Oh my god. This is exactly what they've needed for a very, very long time. And they need to socialize about meal. So let's see. Let's socialize about meal. We probably have to wait for our food to do that. I'm guessing, but maybe not. I noticed this girl has been on her phone the whole damn time. I don't know how I feel about that. No. Sit. I'm gonna have to um, delete that bar out because I'm, I already know that that's actually gonna be an issue with any restaurant that I put down. Yeah, see? Order drink. They're, they're just gonna constantly get up and go over to the bar. There we go. I might actually go into build buy mode now, and that's one thing I love about Sims 4, is that you can just do that. I might go in here just to get rid of this bar, because I already know that that's going to be a main issue. I'll keep the little, you know, food stand for, like, maybe if they want dessert or something. But other than that, I'm not going to keep the bar, because that's just ridiculous. Yeah. Because they're going to keep wanting to go over and order a drink. So that's that on top of that, you know. And they have a lot of good moolahs right now. Decorated. We have comfy. We have romantic atmosphere from the aura. Titillating banter. And hot dinner date. They're taking forever to deliver our food. <laughs> Resume placemat. Let's have her do it. Let's have her do it. <laughs> We're going to have her draw on it, too. That's just funny to me. We'll have them both do it. And they acquire the painting skill when they do that. That's hilarious. <coughs> have, have deep conversations with your dates. You know what? Let's do that. Deep conversation. It's probably under friendly, I'd assume. There it is. Deep conversation. <laughs> That is perfect for a restaurant. When you go out to eat, you do have deep conversations. Oh, here it is. 
Oh, it's steaming hot. Come through, yes. Here's your order, delish. We might actually just stick with eating the appetizers. I've noticed that. Oh, and they have their drinks. That's so cool. Oh my god. I live. You know what? We're going to drag it into the inventory. We're going to drag those into the inventory. We're going to keep those. And that is awesome. Cheers. That. Oh my god, you guys. You guys. This restaurant. I never even explored this restaurant pack. And I live for it already. It's dope. You know, since we're tight on money, we might actually just eat these appetizers and not even order a full course. That's so cool. I wonder if they can cheers. I wonder if they can cheers. That would be really, really cool. Let's, um, can we talk about the food? I wonder if we can talk about food. Discuss food flavors. Complain about dish. Do not complain about dish. You don't, when you're out on a date like that, do not complain about what you're eating. That's, that's not, that's not cool. Enthuse about meal. Let's do that. There's so many packs that you can, like, choose. I feel like that's really cool. What else can we talk about? Trying to find just like food stuff. <laughs> That's cool. I love it. We might just stick with the appetizers because they were expensive and it looks like it's filling them up. We're almost there. Come on. All right. We need a deep conversation. Just one more and then we'll be able to get that gold medal. So let's go ahead and do, pause it. Matthew, pause it. Pause it until you get that deep conversation. You gotta get that deep conversation. There it is. There it is. That's really cool. So you're chatting with Amanda. Have a deep conversation. You have like two seconds. Oh, we got it. We got it right before it ended. That's cool. Legendary date. There is something special in your Sims inventory to help remember it. Oh, thank you for cleaning up the food. I appreciate it. I think she cleaned up our drinks because she noticed that we were done. That's really cool. Oh my god, bring out cake. <gasps> we can order cake! Oh my god, I love! I love this. Sims 4, they really outdid their self. They did. I'm glad I deleted that bar too because that was a hot mess. White cake, tiered cake, strawberry cake. Um... Sim City cheesecake. Oh, let's do Sim City cheesecake. <gasps> At least they're both pretty full, which I'm happy about. But I like how it leaves them some room. You know? It leaves them some room. Fumu. <laughs> Fumu. I'm going to have her go ahead and review the restaurant because she is a food critic. So after she ate that meal, she's going to get on her phone and she's going to let them know hey, hey, y'all. Um. I thought I ordered the cheesecake. Did I? Do I have to order it through here? Where is it? I thought I ordered it. Tiramisu. Girl. Girl. Mmm. Apple pie. Oh. Uh, she'll have strawberry cake. And he'll have chocolate cake. There we go. How's that? I swear to God, if they end up bringing out two cakes, I'm going to flip, flip it. What are you doing? Oh, wait for order to be delivered. Browse the web. Is she doing her critic? You doing her? You're, you're doing your critic? Clean out spoiled food. Oh, she's got spoiled food. She's got spoiled food. I'm done. We need to find a trash can so we can get rid of that. How long have we had spoiled food in our inventory? That's disgusting. That's disgusting. And look, she has this little badge thing in her inventory. That's really cool. And they're just on their phones. Just on their phones. They're so cute, though. Aren't they adorable, guys? Let's do it. Express fondness. Let's go ahead and compliment her parents. Tell her she looks pretty. We haven't had our own romantic night out in such a long time time so this is it this is perfect for them and i'm happy that they're finally able to experience it we'll then flirt we'll flirt with her a little bit what else can we do here impressed with video game pros <laughs> that's funny 
They better hurry up and deliver this food. It's already 2 a.m. Girl, where our cake at? Where you... You delivered food for people who aren't even... I'm just done. I'm so done. How long does it take to bake a damn cake? I'm about to give y'all a crappy tip. Okay, here it is. Here's our cake. Poof. Poof. Oh, oh yummy. Look at them. They're like, ah, yes. Dig in. That does look good. That looks amazing. Mmm. I wonder if they get moodlets from the cake. That would be awesome if they got moodlets from the cake. I doubt they'll get a moodlet from the cake, though. Holy crap, you finished that cake pretty quick. All right, and now we're going to go ahead and we're going to take it to the next level, guys. We're going to propose. We're going to do it right here. Right now. Hey, hey, hey. This is it! <gasps> this is it! Oh, this is it! Oh my goodness! Oh, oh my god, they're so cute! <gasps> Look at them! Oh, they are like meant to be, guys. They are meant. To be, aren't they adorable? Oh, <laughs> oh, they're so happy. They had like the best day ever. Engaged. These Sims are engaged to be wed. Save the date. Awesome, awesome. Hot dinner date. All right, we're going home. It's been a long night. We're going home. We have the kids in our rearview mirror. <laughs> this is what we have to deal with when we get home. And they're both dead tired. It's nearly 4 o'clock in the morning, but they had an awesome date. Oh, shit. Did they even pay the bill? <gasps> I forgot to have them pay the bill. I wonder if it pays. I feel bad. I forgot to have them pay the bill. Does it pay automatically? Oh, my God. We just left without paying. I feel so bad. Y'all are probably spamming the comment section right now. Matt, you forgot to pay the bill. There it is. There it is. Okay. Wait. Hey, you left without paying your bill. 118, so we charge you. Don't forget next time. <laughs> okay, cool. Oh my god, I didn't even mean to. I feel so bad. I feel so bad. Okay, that was an awesome, awesome, awesome date. And now we just gotta end it. We gotta end it off with some... Should we try for a baby? Should we try for a baby? Screw it. Let's have one more kid. One more, you guys. How's that sound? Just one more. <laughs> one more kid. One more. Just one more. That's it. Just one more baby. And we'll check for pregnancy in the morning. Wow. So they had a good woohoo. They did. Pleasantly satisfied. Was she pleasantly? Yep, she was. She, oh my god, no, chance of twins! We cannot have two more babies! Oh my god, I forgot about that! If we have twins, I'm gonna kill myself because oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, we can We cannot have twins. We already have way more than we can afford. Guys, we already have way more than we can afford. You know what? Head to sleep. What are you doing? No. Come inside and go to sleep. They're all outside making messes. I do not live for it. I do not live for it. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. And I will talk to all of you guys in the next part. Wow, hopefully you guys enjoyed this part. We got a lot done, and I'm very, very, very happy. Very excited. If we have twins, I'm going to flip shit because, oh my god. But I'll talk to you guys later. I love you all so much. Bye, guys.